We're gonna make uh, some green curry noodles with some cabbage, some roasted cashews, and yeah, a green curry sauce. Maybe some chili oil, maybe some herbs. So I got some oil heating up and we're gonna make the sauce and then we'll cook the noodles and stuff separately. You can make the sauce like ahead of time, make a ton of it and then you have it for the week if you wanna like put it on rice or you can make a soup out of it, but yeah. So I got some ginger, uh, about half an onion, about three or four cloves of garlic, maybe like an inch of ginger. And I cut that all up. We're gonna sweat this until it is soft and translucent. Hit it with some salt. And then in the meantime, we'll prep uh, the stuff that's gonna go in the blender. So I have a bunch of cilantro. I know a lot of people don't like cilantro. So you can sub this out for uh, flat leaf parsley if you want, but I'm gonna put a good bunch in here With cilantro you don't have to worry about the stems too much like try and take from the tops, but It's not uh, it's not really essential. They'll blend So like a cup a cup about I'm also gonna use some parsley now this stuff I want to use just the leaves And you can put as much or as little as you want of this. Don't worry about this fucking shit bag. Looks bad. What you do? Well, get it like that. So what we're gonna be making today is a little fruit. Yeah. Say it. It's a little Brussels sprout. This is the Brussels sprout. Bullshit. Yeah, obviously, but like you're, you have a bowl full of them. That's for a different dish. Oh, you're doing another one then? Yeah. You can buy some of this. You can also make it, but uh, I don't feel like making it. So I just bought some, it's like three bucks. And it's green curry paste. It's kind of spicy. Um, but if you want the less spicy version, uh, get red curry paste, but I like the green. Like, that looks like poo. That looks like poo. Um, <laughs> Well, it just looks like poo in the pan. Um, okay. Kind of toast this until it smells just as good as the other stuff. And then we're also gonna toast some uh, peanut butter in here. Not, normally you roast this a little bit in here, but I'm gonna put it in last because this is actually dark roast peanut butter. So I don't really need to cook this out much. <coughs> Fucking spicy. Um, we're gonna add some water now, just to help dissolve everything. You can, like ideally, if you're gonna make a soup or something, when you add the liquid now, you'd use veg stock. But since we're just making it into a sauce, I'm just gonna use water. It's seasoned, and then we'll also add uh, some coconut milk, <laughs> like two thirds of a liter, probably. <laughs> We're back. <laughs> Needed a. <laughs> uh, it's cooked, or like, yeah, we cooked the aromatics. Uh, added some coconut milk. Turned it off the heat. I'm, I want to cool this. I want it to be nice and cold. If you put it in the herbs and blend it like while it's hot. Uh, all these herbs will turn brown and since we want it to look like a green curry and make it look really fresh We need this to be cold So Just put it in the fridge until it's cold Shit, dude, that's fucking spicy Okay, so we're gonna add uh, To the herbs of one lime. We're gonna add the zest of one lime in here And 
And we're also gonna add the juice of the lime in there as well. If you like, if you're making this ahead of time, you wanna buy two limes to garnish with one later, you can do that, but I just like to put the lime juice all in there so that it's mixed in. That are pretty small. Uh, you guys have seen me use these before. Um, I'm just gonna use about half a package. Um, they're like a buck fifty. I eat these all the time, and it's kind of um, cool. You can like they cook just really quickly, and you can make like this sauce. You can make any sauce you want. You can make sesame sauce. You can make a peanut sauce. Uh, make whatever you want, but make a big batch of it. That way you have it prepped for the week, and then all you have to do when you come home is cook some noodles with whatever vegetables you want, and that's it. Today I'm gonna use some of this cabbage. When you start getting to like the edge of vegetables, this works with onions too, and it starts to get like a little bit wobbly, you can just lay it down, and then it's stable again. Uh, we're just gonna make like a little herb garnish. Green onions, one of my favorite things. Whole peanuts shell on when I get them. Just put them in the blender, hit pulse a couple times till they're like dusty like this. This is like the best texture. Cause it'll like mix in with the noodles as you eat them. You can like just get halved peanuts, but they'll slide off your fork and you'll end up at the bottom of the bowl with a bunch of peanuts that didn't end up in your bite. And then I'm also gonna use some of my chili oil. I think that I'm pretty close to sold out, but uh, Hopefully there'll be some more in a month or two or whatever. Um, but you can also buy chili oil, but it's not as good as this, but uh, you, this is optional. It's already spicy, so this is just because we're gonna make it really spicy because Brendan is eating it with someone and we wanna see what their tolerance is like. So we're making it super spicy. Package. <laughs> you can drop them. You can do it nicer than that if you want. And the cabbage won't take as long to cook. I want the cabbage to be a little bit crisp still. So when these are almost done, I'll drop them in the water just for like a minute. We end up start doing thumbnails like this. <laughs> Imagine. The best green curry. Huh? So this is cooled. And we're just gonna add it all to here. Okay, so that's a nice green color we're looking for. That tastes so good, dude. So I'm just gonna add this cabbage now and just cook it for like a minute. Put everything back in here. Mix that one right in and then we'll save the others for the top. Sauce it. Stitching we're gonna make for the salt. For the final salt, we'll use some good soy sauce. We'll mix in a few peanuts. A couple tablespoons. We got some roasted cashews. We got some of the best chili oil. You'll be fine, man. That's not even that much. I eat like triple that amount. Yeah, what's your view? That's different. And then lots of herbs. Thai green curry noodles. I've actually been eating this one a lot. 